Welcome back everybody to Make Share Daily where you can go get a new fresh build each and every day. Today we're gonna do a five minute Lego challenge and we're gonna see what we're gonna build by spinning the wheel. Fortnite. So yesterday we did a Fortnite crate. Today we got an open-ended Fortnite. So that means anything in the genre of Fortnite. Pretty cool. Game is highly addictive. I've played it on the iPad. I've played it in some other forms as well. And it's very addictive. So let's go see how I'm going to integrate Fortnite into a Lego build. Let's go see. So the last one for this week is Fortnite. It's open-ended, so Fortnite what? I'm thinking gun. So I think it's gonna be really difficult. I think, I think I'm gonna run out of the five minutes of time, but I'm gonna try to make one of these bazookas. A Fortnite bazooka. Do I think it's gonna work? I don't know. I have some pieces that match up. So I have this piece I have these pieces that I can line up. I'm going to give it a try. We're going to see how it goes, see how far we get. Uh, it could take one minute or it could take 10 minutes or 20 minutes. I'm not sure what it's going to take, but let's get on five minutes on the clock. So the bazooka kind of looks like this. This is the main part that we're gonna use, this, this green part, the end of the bazooka. Then after that, we're gonna have a bunch of these. Our main part's rolling away. And then these two by ones we're gonna use. Okay, and then some of these, these brown pieces we're probably gonna, these brown dots we're probably gonna have to utilize. Maybe even the brown piece. Um, so let's do that. So it sticks out a little bit, then it goes down and it has a sight up there. Then it goes down a little bit more. Then it goes down and up again. Right? See what it looks like. So it, oh, it has a brown piece up here. So we should utilize that. And then this is brown in back. So we're gonna have to use, use some of those colors schemes. So let's use brown up here. There we go. Then it goes up like that. Then a bunch of brown dots. These sights, I'm, I'm thinking we use this instead when it goes up. And the same goes for this. But I wanna make this, the handle, just a little beefier. Then the sight goes up. Okay. Then the brown dots link up. That one doesn't want to join the party. Then, then and up. A black. Hmm. That was a lot quicker than I thought. Yep, that's gonna go back here. Come on now, come on. That looks awesome. That looks amazing. If I if I couldn't match that up any better, I, I don't think I can match that up any better than what it looks like there. Wow, look at that. That is dead on. That's fantastic. I don't think I could do better than that. Even if I had more pieces. Or more different colors. I mean, this might get turned around and put a rod through the middle of this. But, man. Come on, now. That looks great. That looks so awesome. So let's take a picture of that. Because that is fantastic. 
I'm gonna have to do a side-by-side -side comparison of that because I think I think that looks spot on based off of what I saw on the Wikipedia for the Fortnite bazooka. It looks spot on. I don't think I could get any better than what I got right there. Thumbs up for that one. That finishes off this week with a thumbs up because some of the other ones this week were not that great. Doing the Triforce shield, I mean, with the pieces I have, that was really difficult. But this, dead on. Dead on. And it was the smallest build. That's the funny thing is sometimes the smaller you get, the more the design pops with the with the smaller features and everything else. So sometimes that that's a trick. Sometimes you go bigger to get more detail and sometimes you go smaller to get more detail and show off the features that you have and the pieces that you have. I'm pretty proud of that. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you think you can make a better Fortnite bazooka, leave a message down below or go post it on our social medias and subscribe to our social media so you can get pictures and updates of when we're going to be posting these videos. Thanks everyone. Thanks so much for watching. Here at Make Share Daily, we love to make things, especially with Legos. So these five minute challenges are a lot of fun. And if you want to play along, go ahead and pick up this classic Lego box with 221 pieces. You can pick them up for about $15 at your local Walmart or Target and then you can play along. Or just use any other Legos that you have at your house. As long as you build that same topic, find a way to share it with us on all of our social medias. I'll leave it with this. Please go ahead and make something and share something each and every day. You'll be glad that you did it, and we would love to see anything that you make. So find a way to post it to us on our Facebook page, our Instagram page or our Twitter account and you will see all the links down below with where you can get in touch with us. So thanks everybody for watching and we'll see you tomorrow to make something new. See you later. Bye-bye.